Chris Tairo, KTN News, Nairobi. So now Kenya still has a long way to go to fully realize the right to health care for all. And by the International um, uh, Commission of Jurists interrogating the challenges and gaps hindering the full enjoyment of the right to health in Kenya indicates that despite the existence of numerous policy and legislative frameworks on the right to health, attaining this right remains a major challenge for most Kenyans. Gloria Milemo explains. The enjoyment of the highest attainable standard of health is regarded as one of the fundamental rights of every human being. Whereas this right is also envisaged in the Kenyan Constitution under Article 43, Section 1A, experts say this right as currently enacted under national and international laws and policies is far from being enjoyed by most of the population due to various reasons. A review of the legal and policy framework on the right to health care in Kenya by the International Commission of Juries reveals that this right is threatened by various factors that touch on human resource, health financing, health system related obstacles among other challenges. The report indicates that the quality of health care in Kenya is affected by inadequate number of skilled medical personnel, lack of drugs, commodities and equipment in health facilities, lack of safe and portable water, poor sanitation, among other challenges threatening the quality of health care. On accessibility, the report states that discriminatory practices are common within health system, inhibiting access to and full enjoyment of the right to health by members of the marginalized, vulnerable and disadvantaged groups, including women and girls, among other key populations. This right as captured by the report's findings is also affected by inadequate supply and frequent stockouts of medicines and commodities associated with inadequate health facility capacity to plan and forecast and weak procurement processes that are often lengthy and mad with corruption, substandard health facilities and infrastructure among others. The report further says that lack of comprehensive social health insurance scheme against the backdrop of the privatization of health services has effectively led to the exclusion of millions of Kenyans from accessing quality health care services and remains a significant threat to the attainment of universal health coverage. The government hopes to ensure every Kenyan attains the highest standard of health care that is accessible and affordable by 2030 under its its universal health coverage agenda. However, this report indicates that we still have a long way to go to realize this ambitious dream most people have turned elusive. According to the World Health Organization, millions of people are routinely excluded from health coverage due to combination of factors including the commodification of healthcare, the underfunding of the health sector, poor prioritization, discrimination and poverty. To ensure the attainment of the right to health care, the report calls for improvement of legislative and policy reforms and interventions and current health functions that enable the full enjoyment of the right to health. They also recommend the improvement of access to quality health care services through capacity development and technical assistance to counties among other recommendations. Gloria Milimo, KTN News. So now the issues pitting the county government of Mombasa against Mombasa cement that nearly paralyzed a philanthropic uh, 